To comply with LHDNE invoice requirements, this video will guide you through setting up all the mandated fields in SQL account for the master setup. All these setup you only need to do once in SQL account, it will ease your e-invoice submission later. Step 1, go to File, Company Profile. Enter your new business registration number and tax identification number. By clicking the search button, SQL will automatically update your company BRN in TIN. Remember to select your company's MSIC code as well. Under General, you are required to fill an address, ensure that you select Malaysia as the country to enable the e-invoice function, postcode, city, state, and phone. Email is optional. Under the SST tab, if your company is registered for SST, make sure to fill in your sales tax number or service tax number or both. Step 2, Update Customer Info, Go Customer, Maintain Customer. Right-click on the gray panel and select TIN Lookup. This will allow you to update all your customer BRN and TIN numbers without needing to ask each customer individually. If the BRN number is entered, the TIN will be updated automatically. If there is no BRN number in the SQL system yet, you can click the search magnifier icon to update both BRN and TIN. Click Save to finalize the update of your customer BRN and TIN list. Moving on to the buyer profile, under the general field, the following are mandatory, company name, address, country, postcode, city, state, phone, and currency. Email is optional. Next, go to the tax tab. Sales tax and service tax numbers are mandatory only for SST registrants. The new BRN, old BRN, and TIN are auto-updated. If you wish to change the ID type, Example, from non-business to Malaysian individual, select NRIC for Malaysians or passport for non-Malaysians. In the TIN column, you can select from the default TIN options available, such as general public for consolidated e-invoice purposes. Step 3, set up classification, go to stock, maintain stock item. Here, you need to assign a classification code. A list of classification codes provided by LHDN is available for selection. What if you have thousands of items? Don't worry, batch updating the classification code is available. Simply highlight all the items, right-click, and select batch edit value. Choose the classification code and click OK. All the highlighted items will have their classification updated within seconds. Check the classification column to verify the updates. If you have items with different classification codes, repeat the process as needed. With SQL Account, we've streamlined your workflow by integrating features like SSM BRN search and TIN number lookup. This eliminates the need for tedious email exchanges to collect information from customers individually, significantly boosting your company's efficiency. Not a SQL user yet? Visit SQL website to book a free demo today. With SQL, you'll not only ensure compliance with LHDN laws and regulations but also streamline your operational workflow. Start using SQL today.